Yes guys, what's happening? I did a video on my van a couple of weeks ago uh, and I've had some really good feedback on it. So I'd like to do a bit more of an in-depth video on it, on how much it cost me to do the racking, how much I spent on the pack out stuff, how long it took, how much the wood cost me and stuff like that. So, but before I get into it, I need to clean my van. So roll that clip. <music> The heavens have opened. Oh. It says I want to make a video, it's like it's raining. <laughs> right, so the van's clean now, so I can actually concentrate and think about what I'm, what I'm trying to say. So, the guy that built, built this for me, he done it in, in a day, but over two days, that makes sense. So he done like a morning one day, and then he finished it in, in an afternoon on the next day. Um, he was a friend of mine, so it didn't really cost me too much money for it to be built. Uh, I think he charged me just over £200, um, and that was a bit of my help as well. And what we had to do, we tried to basically got all the stuff that I wanted to put into it and built and basically designed it around what I, how I wanted it to be. So I had to cut out, my legs were killing me, so I have to sit down now. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so basically it cost me £200 to get it built. Uh, the wood cost me around four hundred and fifty pounds, but I didn't really, I didn't really choose to do it at the best time. It's when the timber prices were through the roof, and it cost me an absolute fortune. Um, so I, yeah, I think the wood cost about four hundred and fifty pounds. The actual labour was two hundred, but if you would have got anyone else to do that, that done this sort of design, would have charged you a lot more than what I managed to get it for. So, cheers, Carl, for that. All right, yeah. So I was saying, I've spent six hundred and fifty pounds on the timber and the labour to build it. Um, that's not including any of the actual pack out boxes themselves or the van vault or the ladders underneath that's purely just the frame and the labor in timber uh, i've done a bit more calculating on my phone and i've spent 1650 on just these boxes alone that's including the uh, the free drawers the all the crates uh, the pull out drawers the um the, all the organizers and all the other little boxes like these ones and then ones upstairs. So yeah, these ones have always all cost me uh, £1,650. It's obviously a lot of money to spend on these boxes, but I didn't buy them all at once. I spent like little bits and little bits until I ended up with this sort of amount. Um, I don't know, I'll have to work out in a minute. I'm not too sure how much I've spent on the pack out actual clips. I didn't want to buy the Milwaukee ones because they were £50 per one. And obviously, as, as you can see, every single one has got one um and i'll check them in a minute how much i spent on these but i know the the actual milwaukee ones were 50 pounds um so give me a second i'll check so i've done a bit i've looked online and see how much i paid for them these are 30 pounds each instead of 50 i know it isn't that much difference but when you're buying 15 of them it it does make a difference it's, it saves you best part of 200 quid uh, and i spent 450 pounds on just the pack out clips alone so So yeah, as I was saying, the um, the pack out the pack out clips were four fifty on there by themselves. If you add the sixteen hundred and fifty pounds that I spent on the boxes, that's two thousand one hundred um, on just the clips and the boxes themselves. Uh, and then if you add the six hundred and fifty pound labour and um, material uh, wood price, then that takes you to two thousand seven hundred and fifty, uh, and that's to get you pretty much where this van is now i'll take you around the back uh, that's not including any of the clips like this that's not including the van vault which i paid about 300 pounds for the ladders it, the list goes on and on in order to get something along these lines it's probably going to cost you about the best part of three thousand pounds to get this sort of set up all right i'm gonna have to wrap this video up now because it's starting to rain and i don't want to leave it unfinished i think i've covered all the angles on how much i spent on the milwaukee pack out the wood the labor uh, and stuff like that if i've missed anything drop it down in the comments below i'll um i'll get back to you with links or questions that's not been answered and stuff like that but if you like the video smash the like button subscribe because i've got loads of other stuff coming so stay tuned